Previously on Wealth Gambit, this year, 98 casitas were delivered to the federal government so far. It's understandable that they would be in the front of the line. If you want to see their planned timeline, pause this video and check out the schedule to take a sneak peek of their production goals. After getting a ton of hype from the techno king Elon Musk, Boxable, the creator of the famous Boxable casita, is once again gaining some traction. This June, Boxable completed its first official order of 156 casitas to the US government, which cost a whopping $9.2 million. Boxable is currently competing in an industry with many veterans who have been in the housing space for decades. Some have even existed for more than half a century. According to IBISworld.com, the prefab home industry shows a high level of market share concentration. This means Boxable may have to double down to keep up with the veterans that dominate the market. Whether you're a potential customer or an investor of Boxable, this seems to be the key in unlocking Boxable's promising future. And considering how much it has already achieved since it was founded in 2017, Boxable sure has a clear opportunity to disrupt the market. In this video, we'll go over the key details of Boxable's first successful order to the US government, some production plans, and the existing competitive environment it has. We're not financial advisors, and this is not financial advice, so always do your own due diligence. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Boxable has only been in the market since 2017. We believe your time in business doesn't matter as much as results. Boxable has proven that it gets results securing the bag with a $9.2 million contract with the US government despite just being a five-year-old prefab homemaker. After just five years of being in business, seeing the major leaps it's taken, imagine where it's going to be 10, 15, 20 years from now. From the techno king, Elon Musk, praising Boxable in a tweet to government orders, Boxable is taking strides to dominate in the prefab home industry. As of December 2021, Boxable received over 4,000 deposits for approximately 4,700 orders of its $50,000 casita. The long wait list goes on. This June, Boxable has now completed 156 orders of the casita to the US government, and this accounts for a whopping $9.2 million of gross revenue alone. Boxable co-founder Galeano Tiramani even said, the fact that we were able to quickly stand up a new factory, hire hundreds of people, mass produce a brand new product category, and deliver on this huge initial order speaks volumes of our team's competence and ability to deliver on our promises. Big things to come. When did the solution to housing problems get this simple? A house built up in a factory shipped instantly unboxed in an hour? At this rate, Boxable is really out there staying true to their mission of housing meat mass production. So what's next for Boxable? Now that they've completed their first order and successfully built their first factory in Las Vegas, Boxable is set to make more boxes for consumer testing and reviews. After the long wait, people who have placed deposits should hopefully get their casitas in the up and coming months. If you take a look towards the end of the planned timeline. After a few months, Boxable plans to build its second production facility. They're currently working on getting a factory franchise business model where Boxable will become a logistics company with franchises constructing factories around the world. With that idea, Boxable can get another stream of revenue that, that caters to the demand for raw materials, custom equipment, branding, quality control, and all that jazz. As of this year, 440 parties are interested in teaming up with Boxable from 17 states and 25 countries. Imagine the amount of growth Boxable can do in the up and coming years. But here's the catch. The industry is ripe for innovation, just like the finance space. And some of the veterans in the prefab home industry have an advantage being in the modular home industry for years. One of the biggest names in the industry is Clayton Homes, an Energy Star certified company with more than half a century experience in housing design. It's one of the largest modular home builders in the space, with 13,400 employees in the US and a record of more than 34,000 homes built in 2015. There are a lot of companies standing strong, even up to this day, dominating the market. But did you know that Clayton Homes is also owned by the 91 year old Oracle of Omaha, AKA Warren Buffett? For approximately 19 years, Clayton Homes has been a part of the Berkshire Hathaway family of companies, building, selling, financing, and insuring every home built from scratch. Who knows? 
According to thomasnet.com, Boxable is competing against these beasts in the modular home industry. Some of them are Cavco Industries, founded in 1965 with an annual sales of approximately $250 million. Another is Commodore Corporation, with $100 to $249 million of annual sales. And Warren Buffett's Clayton Homes also made it to the list with about $25 to $49.9 million of annual sales. Comment your thoughts down below. Do you think Boxable will be able to catch up or better yet surpass these companies many of them are veterans in the industry either building selling financing or insuring any type of home and this is the space where boxable compete there's a ton of potential for boxable considering that there is a massive opportunity for the prefab home space because of the rising prices of home but everything comes with a price and this involves a threat probably coming from the existing competitors of boxable like clayton homes who's been in the housing industry for 66 years the competition in the housing industry may seem like a a tough ground for Boxable, but the company isn't showing any signs of backing off. Last April, Boxable announced an offering of approximately 85.6 million shares of non-voting Series A2 preferred stock, and investors can buy it at around 80 cents per share at the time of recording this. But on top of that, they can also buy non-voting Series A1 preferred stock at 79 cents per share, whereas Boxable serves up to 12.7 million shares. But for those who like to buy non-voting Series A preferred stock, Boxable will offer 35.7 million shares at around 14 cents per share. If you're interested in the common stock of Boxable, we've got you covered. According to their circular offering, it will only happen once they receive total gross proceeds amounting to at least $15 million from Series Series A2, Series A1, and Series A preferred stock. Boxable has recently announced a partnership with DR Horton, aka the largest home builder in the USA. Boxable and DR Horton will work together to sell more casitas. Boxable's completion of the government order looks as if the company is nearing its warm up phase, and right now, it's getting ready to take on bigger opportunity. If you haven't already, make sure to follow us on our social media pages at Wealth Gambit. The link will be in the description box below. A special shout out to everyone in our patreon community you guys truly help to make these videos possible and we really appreciate all the support shout out to arthur magazu wei chu pietro Serra, daniel corbett mr welfare casey patel jeff sherman gregory villar Bo park denzil reginald davis les broadway christian cardelfi kevin bofran jay bone daniel zintson and abc sam we really appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And until next time, peace.